pretty much like what is it you know how some games lately they have those like audio description notes and yeah we got anyway. another great match coming up for you guys a a, uh, versus promo uh by the way this was a uh, one of our commissioned pieces of art we did get caboozle drawn from scratch <laughs> And, uh, I, I really hope that that costs the same as every other piece. Like, <laughs> Potatoes <laughs> just looking at it like, all right, free free money, I guess, whatever. Easy, but yeah, we got Caboozled right here versus Promo uh, holding that Ringo knife. Very scary. Um, yeah, Promo recently set up that new Twitch account, so be sure to support them uh, if you haven't yeah, already. Not, that's like a fresh thing. Now, what I'm wondering is Caboozled's garage up for a bounty again in this one? Because I... Oh, no, if you were in here pants last night, uh, there are some connected versus not, was... And Caboozled's dad came in the chat and said, if you lose, you're sleeping in the garage tonight. <laughs> Dude, Caboozled's awesome. That's the kind of life I need. Uh, I, might, I moved out from the dads, but uh, I guarantee if I was like, don't come in here, I'm commentating matches, he'd be like, can I get you something? Can I get you anything? Do, do you need a drink to, so you don't have to stand up? Very supportive. Uh, they keep messaging me. Yeah, but uh, Caboozle's dad's yeah. a great guy, and Caboozle's also a great guy. Going against Promo, the third great guy we've been talking about. And these are all great players, and this is a great tournament. It's a great game. What what else can you... It's, it's all great. This is about... Edge it's about is also cool. Couldn't quite use the word great for me there, but, you know... <laughs> Uh, I, I'm, I'm noticing off the jump, uh, that, like, like a lot of players have been, oh, we get a PC from promo side, uh, T-spinning is way there, pretty, uh, pretty nifty stuff. But, uh, yeah, got promo coming in here, uh, looked like they wanted that fractal, but unfortunately Q was, uh, not in favor, so he's had split up the T-spins. Caboozled already popping off the zone here. Have it skimming for the T-spin, one thing that I noticed about Caboozle's playstyle, I pointed this out last night as well, is that they're one of the few players who aren't afraid to skim in between their T-spins. Mm -hmm. Some people of, are, uh, they're addicted to it, they're like, I need to T-spin, if I don't... Yeah, some people are like, some people are really uh, up up in the air about like, uh, or not up in the air, some people are really up to like, trying to keep back to back as much as possible, compromising a lot for it, but if Caboozle sees a simpler T-spin, they, they don't mind skimming one line until going into the next one. Boozled mm -hmm. is starting another zone. I think this looked like a full. There's no reason it couldn't have been a full. Uh, yeah, we got this 18 here. Ulti coming up for the folks. Ooh. Looks like we were almost yeah. there. I just don't think the pieces align. Nor the stars or the planet. Uh, pretty solid zone coming in from promo side. Pretty just focused on Petrus's line clears, but able to get the 20 lines cleared Ultimatris for the 55 attack. I'm literally just reading what's on the screen. Yeah, but uh, what I'm also reading on the screen is that garbage meter from Caboozle is going to be a lot to work through. Uh, it's just not going to work there. Look at how fast promo's playing and nearly one APP at that too. This guy's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> pro pro promo's a force to be reckoned with. Absolutely. But continuing on here, 6 3 stacking yet again. Oh. Uh, promo cooking up some uh, attacks here. Uh, looks like they're just going to skim through that, and uh, Caboose is yeah. just using that super clean just garbage. A little bit of an awkward start. Didn't really look like too many misdrops were going on there. Just a little bit of a, uh, you know, what am, I, what am I going to do with these pieces, and what can I get done? Yeah. But uh, right now we got that first zone attack coming in from Caboozle. This is looking pretty good right now. Lots of T-spins happening. Oh, I thought that they were going to try and go for that triple this high. But a great eye spin there. Uh, going to net an extra line or two in that zone. Meanwhile, Promo, Promo already is... counted up 18. Promo at least digs himself a T-spin double to leave the zone with. And wow, already takes it over Caboozle. I'd say that he's uh, twisting the knife here. Uh, his avatar has a knife. Promo is building up, uh, convincing 6-3. We all know he's the 6-3 guy. Uh, we got a little bit of 
self-made cheese going on at the top. Looking for the T-piece just so we can get that T-spin double damage activated. Caboozle doing a T-spin double zero. Uh, yeah, Caboozle unfortunately uh, had a bit of a rough there. stack to work with right now, but uh, Promo here still keeping it super clean. Caboozle's getting back down there using that yeah. Mr. Clean Magic Eraser. Just uh, getting themselves oh, straight oh. back down. Yeah, it looked like both players were kind of having a little bit of a misshapen start, a little unevenness there, but uh, now it seems like they've sort of broken into their stride. Yeah, promo uh, again creating Ooh, some holes, but a uh, great C spin start there in yeah. that zone from Kabuzo. That was super, like, Jerry Rig. Still working out very well, though. A little bit ballsy here. Ooh. Ooh. Getting that vertical JP. There's a little bit like, of cheese on the way out, but that's 68 damage. And like, it's weird to say off of only 20, but like, usually like- Yeah, but then you got that 43 there. Promo has a lot of garbage to work with. Gonna be hard to survive. The pieces were not in his favor there. And you see that uh, floating TSP setup from Caboozle. Yeah. You don't see just that like, often. Just more proof that if you're in the zone and you really want that attack, like do some T-spins. If they're triples, if they're doubles, just do them. Get them out of the way. But yeah, continuing on here, 6-3 uh, is again the classic for both these players. Caboose seems to be accepting a bit more garbage earlier, not really uh, trying to look to cancel that, just uh, using the super clean phase one stuff that's being brought to them. Mm -hmm. Promo is setting up that T-spin double in the middle. Stack's looking a little uh, not 6-3, if that makes sense. We're at 0-9 right now. Yeah, that is a, not a 6-3 stack, believe it or not, if anyone was contemplating it in chat. Uh, <laughs> is it really that bad? Thanks. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes, you know, I just I kind of fill the air, you know how it is. Promo sending a 54 attack over to Caboozle's side. Caboozle's not really worried about it. We only got two entire lungs. Story changes quickly. Yeah, of course, you know, two to one right now, uh, about midway through phase two, getting closer and closer to phase three. One more zone from either player is going to do it at this point. Uh, but I'm wondering if they're just going to wait on it, because right now, neither player feeling uh, inclined to zone. Yeah, I would say that Caboozle probably should have gotten the train started a little earlier, because now this gives Promo the, uh, you know, the comfort to sort of get something going here send the higher amount of damage and leave Kabooza on the defensive. Only able to clear 18 lines and huh, interesting how that happened. Probably because Kabooza sent a little bit before activating the zone himself. We got Promo just playing down stack right now. Uh, pretty, I mean, you couldn't do better than that. You literally could not do better than that. You got to the bottom. That's down stack to a T. And Boozle able to send a Tetris back, negating some damage. Promo's getting some uh, classy cheese over at the bottom of his stack, uh, trying to find access into whatever holes the damage randomizer is sending. Probably going to see some zone activations here in a second. Both players are at maximum zone. Uh, I think they're just both trying to find some momentum and uh, somewhere to dig their feet into before popping it. Promo is playing a mean and fast zone, whereas Caboozle's got a little bit of digging to do. This L piece is gonna help out. Uh, not able to build up the same stack and the same damage as Promo though. This is gonna have to instant zone just to get some of this damage off, but bad news, there's gonna be more damage waiting for you on the other end of it. Uh, yeah, look at all that cheese up there, bit. you know. That's just the difference. So much cheese on Caboozled's side and Promo was literally just like, literally, it was a clean plate right there. Literally ate all this food. That's just literally, what there. Literally, the food was eaten. You could see it happen on stream. Absolutely. Uh, didn't know Promo start oh, using that face cam. But bit of, bit of a weird drop. Bit of a weird drop on Caboozled's side. That's going to be really hard to get to if Promo can dig that knife. Oh, no! Oh, man. Uh, that one was awkward. That was really awkward. <laughs> Promo takes a, a homie stock. Uh, let's see if he will reciprocate it nicely. No, we're playing honest. That's fair. When you're when you're dealing yeah. with, with a tournament like this, you're like, look, I got a free point. I gotta keep going. 
Yeah, so uh, here we go. Uh, Promo coming in. Fourth point. Caruso still at one. Let's see if they can accelerate p their position anymore on the board. Uh, definitely playing well enough to do it. It's just that later in phase three, losing a little bit of that mojo that's been uh, allowing them Jay to push up. Okay, Grizzled is getting some footing, but not too much. Uh, I think we're gonna need to see a zone pop soon. Yup, okay. Yeah, there he goes. Pop. Yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, Grizzled side is looking pretty efficient right now. Uh, I like how opted for go like the T-spin single rotation there, knowing that he didn't have the double. And Promo is able to send back a, a good amount more of damage, but nothing too scary for Grizzled. Uh, Luz has been giving himself a, little, a wide berth of survival area. But yeah, phase three coming in now. Uh, Ed Caboozle just trying to stay down as much as possible. Got sampled again by Promo, continuing to downstack. Uh, Promo here building a 5-4 above the garbage. Just uh, really using whatever's thrown at them. Great forecast of T-spins coming out. We got a downstack zone here from Caboozle. Uh, great. Wow, I think, we're getting, there. I think we're getting the whole thing. thing. Oh, wow. There was a... Uh, that could have even was, been a, a 21 or a 22 even. Yeah, so, I was about to say, there was impossibilitous potential there. I think that's the first time that we've seen a zone like that in this entire tournament where there's possible uh, O spawn impossibilitous. So huge shout out to Kevin. Impossible impossibilitous. Yeah, uh, not something that you necessarily hear of both uh, grammatically with just the words and uh, as well as how hard 22 clears are uh, to pull off. Yeah, they're very um, meditated. Almost feels like you can really only get away with them in single player. So it's yeah. interesting to see us reaching so close to the, the promised land. The, the mecca of zone, or, yeah, zone battle matches. Ooh, we're getting zone pops from both sides. Did Gabuzo pop us earlier or was that a full four? Ooh, uh, I think it might have been popped early because the damage on Promo yeah. side is not significant. And Promo also did, did a three-quarter zone. Yeah, 48 attack is going to be a lot for Kabooza right here. On this, one. this is a uh, this is a half meter here. Some stuff can be put out, but this is a, the main use for that, that is just going to get Kev low on the board. Damage. We have we have exit room, but not enough. That's that's the match or that's the round. With Promo taking yet another over Kabooza. Yeah, let's uh, look at that. 143 look at drops a minute for three minutes. In no literally mistrust. every statistic, the promo was just completely dominant there. Promo speed demoning right now. Yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll have some stuff to say after this match. Oh, but we have some really big mistrust. Are we going to see an early top out for promo? Oh, oh man. Crap. All right, Caruso getting more yeah, on the board. Yeah. I, I said promo was going to reciprocate the homie stock at some point in the set. And uh, if you look at Caboozle, 156 drops per minute. But I mean, like, off of the start, of course it's going to happen. You're playing sprint right there. All right, continuing on. More sprint gaming, as we're seeing right here with the 6-3 stack. Just trying okay. to uh, get yeah, filter homies. Yeah, it's piece. Going to try and... Yeah, we, we correct it. Just need to find a J somewhere. Where's my J? Where's my J? After you don't need it. Oh yeah, great double Tetris coming in there from Promo. Uh, Caboozle's gonna yeah. have to take some damage from that. Promo's Trying playing to... the back-to-back -back game big time, and we get the full meter from Caboozle. Gonna be able to start sending damage in a big way. Yeah, there we go. That's All right, that now this is finally coming. Time to pop zone. Yeah, Caboozle looked like they were struggling for a little bit there just to handle all that pressure from Promo, but uh, now kind of yeah. Able to handle it a bit more. 1747. But speaking of popping zones early, Promo Promo had 46 attack of a 14 lines. Yeah, oh, unfortunately yeah. that was uh, that was cut a little short there because uh, I needed yeah. that eye piece for the Tetris, but uh, wasn't going to be it, given to them. Yeah, or that T piece for the uh, T spinner at the top just had some garbage pieces and a little bit of a weird misdrop going on right there. Clean it up. Oh, it's clean. Give me that access to that hole! That's the actual vocalization of how Promo's sounding right now. Oh uh, yeah, again we got that live audio feed from earlier coming back in yeah. again. But uh, speaking I, of I, live, live zone attack on Caboozled's side. 
Got an 18 line 42, and uh, Promo's yeah. got some garbage to work with for this one. Are they gonna make it down or just uh? Yeah, green for a Tetris, sure, yeah. Yeah, we got green for T-spins. We got green going all the way up to 16 lines on that. That kind of looks a little uh, undoable. Very shocked that. Well, I guess I shouldn't be too surprised with what Promo's putting up right now. Yeah. Oh, early zone pop. That's that's a that's a omen right there. Yep. And Kaboozled takes the pretty freaking legit match around. Yeah, catching a promo lacking a little bit. We saw near one APP play before, but that time is near 140 and 110. So uh, Kaboozled able to catch up a little bit there. Promo's just like a speed demon tonight. Uh, haven't seen him play this fast recently, but coming through with consistent 130s, high 130s, 140s. Sometimes even yeah. getting a little bit close to 150. I'm scared of this guy, dude. All right. <laughs> Might as well actually oh, be Ringo we holding just a knife in real that life. insane series of drops over on promo side to create that T-spin tower? That was, that was messed up. That was yeah, like... It looks like uh, they're cool. still going on that one. Uh, no I know. To the top. I think it was like he had like an S and L and S and L and dropped them like... Doo -doo -doo -doo. Like, I'm, I'm talking within frames of each other. That... Oh, oh. Yeah, you were talking earlier about how players are just like refusing to lose the back-to-back, -back, and I think that is a promo. <laughs> that is promo 100% right now. This promo is a back-to-back -back kind of guy, but a 1963 from Kabuzel versus oh, that but... 50 from uh, promo, but promo's back-to-backs outside the zone are just going to help negate those extra 13 lines. Yeah, oh, and speaking of back-to-backs, we're, we're staying in there. We're staying in that pocket. Yeah, of course, you know, we got, uh, we got Kabuzel showing off uh, how well they can optimize their zones, but Promo just playing the out-of-zone game right now. Yeah, Promo playing a 4-5 right now, definitely not what he's most known for, but <laughs> kind of making it look like he could be. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, a little bit of a, a stinky misdrop, but not the most stinky one in the world. Because we're still able to get a T-Spin single out of it. Yeah, a huge spike of garbage incoming from Promo if they weren't in the zone. Able to neutralize all of it. And now, literally, I think exact same garbage when you just got mirrored over the cab side. Yeah. Uh, which is uh, going to be rough. Down uh, packing to do with this yeah. phase 3 damage. Looking ugly. Yeah, but a uh, down stack uh, prowess looking good from Kaboozled right now. Even stacking up for Tetris at this point, not letting yeah, the guard down yeah. at all versus Promo. Both these yeah, players are uh, showing off. Action, just same keeping the right damage now. alive to at least stay in the fight. Promo definitely has the stack advantage right now, but Kaboozled gets a full zone and you can totally bring this back with that. I think I might have saw three damage lines on the Kaboozled side. I but think we had a like 10 right? and 23 come in from Kaboozled. Pretty damn good. Promo gonna have to negate this garbage meter, or else it's gonna look a little ugly. Yeah, I would say the, the deficit is in Promo's favor for the zone damage. And yeah, and now we got Promo like 6 3 uh, stacking again. This, uh, about looking for an S piece or Z piece and just too many S's. Yeah, when Promo signed up that 6 3 stack with solo garbage, it was like uh, digging a grave just waiting to yeah. push Kev in there because Promo 6 3 stacking is something you don't want to mess with. And this is a really bad omen. Promo's the 6-3 guy. What's his record in this round, in this match right now? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> this didn't make it. to graduate. I'm sorry, Chad. I want to be optimistic for Caboozled, but, like, the numbers are just here for, for yeah. Promo. It's 6-3 in his favor. I watched enough Nick Cage movies to know how this is going. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> just... But... Kabuzo does hit the, they, the zone max a little earlier. Uh, you're saying our course, tournament so. isn't getting any more scripted, and what I tell you is, you're wrong. Yeah. The only way this could be more scripted is if we had Promo playing on the left, so that it showed a 6-3, but everybody can interpret what I'm saying. There's no miscommunication here. Our chat's smart people. Let's see, it like can't that. even be that perfect if we actually had a script. Ooh, we're getting a- Ooh, we're getting a twist! Ooh, Caboozle just set a very interesting 1953 promo zone's looking pretty bad right now, actually. Yeah. 
looking close to the can make right it down, now. but uh, I think yeah. it might be a 6 4 game, and that's not a stacking method in Tetris. Yeah, this is, speaking of speaking of bad omens, we're about to flip over to the other side of the script. Maybe uh, maybe oh. the 6 3 score could have been a curse on promo, you know, actually reducing the effectiveness of that 6 3 stack. Yeah, not really sure how these things uh, work. Tale of hubris and gumption and foolhardiness. Uh, as many Greek tales have gone. Yes, but uh, by your pride. I don't. I don't know if the Greek people had this uh, phase three zone action coming in from Kabuzold. Yeah, there was no way they could have anticipated this. Uh, so we we can though. We can anticipate quite a big attack coming through 17 and 49 phase Dude, three keys. Almost has full zone. It doesn't. Oh, you did get full zone. Yeah. Got full <laughs> zone and then immediately used it. This guy, this guy, dude. Oh my dude. god. It probably wins this one. Well. I, I'm not going to eat my hat, but I'm going to do something equivalent to uh, that old uh, adage. Yeah, the Greeks weren't uh, anticipating Kabuzel's zone attack, but they weren't anticipating that comeback either, let me tell you. Yeah. Yeah, Kabuzel is now dealing with a fair amount of cheese. We're, we're, we're talking full-on monster over here, because it's it's definitely one monster. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, and this is uh, looking at, like a little bit of a toughie to downstack for Kabuzel, but gonna pop that zone meter so they don't have to accept anything in the meantime. Yeah, Finding great T spins. Able to get, get some twist action in there with the T spin and the S piece. Yeah, just continue to move the way down into cleaner patches of garbage. <laughs> Kabuzel survived. Yeah. Kabuzel is going to have to play on the extra uh, anticipatory right now, because yeah. any damage that he allows is going to hurt. And, oh, oh, oh speaking oh, of which, that hurts. Took all of that it? Stings. I was expecting that. Yeah. Promo just had such a, not, not the most efficient zone, but still pretty effective, all things considered. Yeah, when Kabuzel's like hard on defense right now, there's really not gonna be a lot of room for them to attack, but they're definitely holding their own against this promo pressure right now. Yeah. This is a this is a story of survival on two different uh, accounts. This is like a The Revenant starring Leonardo DiCaprio. <laughs> oh man, but we got that 1842 coming in from promo. Only having to use a three quarter meter here. This might be rough, especially I since this is all down deck uh, carried. There's literally no T spins in this zone. Yeah, not yeah, very only efficient. Only setting 25 yeah. attack from 17 lines? Yeah, at the beginning we had Kabuzel putting Promo on the struggle bus, then Promo reverses it, and now Kabuzel's like, nah man, that beginning yeah. in the match story, we're still we're still writing that here. If, if there was before. ever a match that could end in a draw, I know, not exactly possible, uh, this would be the one. Well, I mean, it is possible, it just has to uh, have insane internet and like have them both top out at like the exact same time, yeah. including the ping. Oh, looks like Kabuzel is sort of fighting their uh, time. Oh, Too greedy for that T-spin right there. Oh, it's almost staying over 130 drops per minute the entire time. I oh know. My God. That was absolutely crazy, man. Well, GG's uh, to both players. And uh, Promo going to be moving on to that top eight. Seven yeah. to three score. Amazing stuff.